Missed it. Ah. This food was just in the air, flying across the street, and now it's on my plate. What's up, what's up, it's your boy, this is Ace Live, and today, finally, we're gonna check out some of the food here in Thailand, and I'm starting right here at this restaurant right here. Uh, if you remember who I came here with, gentleman named Ja, this is the first place he brought me to, okay? So he was telling me about something about they do where they throw food from one side of the street to the next, all right? I'm here kind of early, because I want to see if they'll allow me to film, and so we can look at some of the food they create here, all right? You know I'm taking you with me. Uh, we're gonna try some of the food. Let's do it. All right now, as you can see, everybody is hustling, busting around four o'clock to get things started. It's, uh, it didn't look like this, okay? It looked like an empty lot, so if you come a little early, you're not gonna see this. But four o'clock, they're setting up, getting everything ready. I, I am not getting ready to eat right now. But, but I like to see the, the setup, it's kind of interesting. This seems to be a very popular uh, spot for the locals. So if you're wondering, are you getting some authentic food? I think you are, okay? Straight up authentic type of Thai food. They, they are going in on everything um, with the broth as well. Looks like it's a nice chicken soup. I don't know if I can wait that long with all this food around. I, I ate some breakfast today, but yeah. This looks like they're um, boiling some geese right there. It looks like some interesting food, yes. I am one of those guys that says try to eat street food, but I am end up at KFC or something traditional, so I wanna step out of my comfort zone and start eating some food authentic to the area I'm in. So I already ate some food here, so I didn't film it, but I'm gonna film it today. And uh, yeah, I'm excited about this place. To find someone that speaks English, perhaps they can give me some history about this place. Hey, somebody's gonna be eating some of this tonight. Mmm. Look at these guys go at it though. <laughs> I haven't found anybody that speaks solid English. However, they do have the menus in English. So I'm gonna go around and try to figure out what I can eat and possibly stay in my diet. Last time I was here, guys, I ended up getting this right here. It was like a hot, spicy, soft-boiled egg salad, and uh, it was all right. It was different. The pepper was different. It, 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 it had a sour taste to it, but I was willing to try it, so I am willing to try anything else. Look, they got deep-fried hot dogs, they call it sausage. This would be my comfort food I would order, but we're not getting this, all right? This is the tourist area. So the prices are a little bit higher, still cheap, but higher. Because I know someone's gonna say I could have went somewhere else. But if you're in the tourist area and you wanna be around the ambiance, here you go. This is a this is one of your options. I will be checking other options though. So I just finished talking to the staff. They said they would allow me to film, so I'm kinda hyped. However, they won't be doing the flying thing today. So we're gonna be coming back tomorrow to film that part as well. But uh, it's interesting to see the dedication they're doing right now. As you can see, I don't know if they have a party waiting or this is, the, this is how they set up every single day. coming in this place is totally getting packed I finally figured out what is going on over there it is a big group of people coming and they're just reserving a seat that might be for a tour company and so they're just serving they're just holding the food for them that's why you see all that food is ready they just want to be prepared once the, the group shows up things are looking up it appears that I will be able to try the stir-fried morning glory this is actually what it is it's 200 baht if you want to try that experience this is a thing i'm like what the heck let me try you know what i mean and i'm also getting a, a rice shrimp soup okay all right guys they're getting ready to uh cook that that's something i ordered and he's gonna cook it and then he's gonna fling it all the way over there to that guy wow 
Thank God he told me to get out of the way. I was not ready for that. And so there's a guy over there in the other corner he's supposed to fling that to. Let's... Wow, okay. There's some broth in there. He's reaching the broth, the oil. He's... Wow, he's like squeezing all the juice off of there. Wait a minute. He's about to do something. Yo! That was insane. It happened so fast too. And then he puts the sauce right back in the... Okay, so the nut, no loss on the sauce. I think this is going to be my order right here. Yo! Missed it? Ah, we'll get another one. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go for another try. Love to see that. Did he get it? Yay! Dope! So, all right guys, there is the stir fry flying vegetable. Sometimes it's just about the experience you have. So, I got I got this food and uh, I'm just excited to eat it. You know what I mean? Just just knowing that this thing was in the air and flying across the street and now it's on the table. It's ridiculous. <laughs> they try to eat this and so you can have an everlasting experience because that's that's just amazing. My um, soup came with the shrimp inside of it. You can see it's in a nice broth with rice inside, okay? I'm not supposed to be eating rice because of my diet, but for you guys, what the heck. So I'm gonna try this food right now. Mm. The broth is really good. <laughs> I know, I, like, it, I was smiling because I know I ain't supposed to be eating this right now, but all right. You gotta sacrifice, this is sacrifices. Mmm, very good. They asked if I wanted it hot, spicy, it's not spicy where you, you're you gonna cry or something. It's a nice spice, nice pepper flavor, flavor to it. It does have a garlicky taste to it. Definitely could taste the basil and the onions. All right, I know what you're gonna say. They gave me a spoon, but I am now getting chopsticks, okay? <laughs> thank you very much, okay, thank you. Now they have similar soups. I opted for the shrimp, because I haven't ate shrimp in a while, but you could have this in with chicken, pork. <laughs> we got the shrimp, we're gonna try the shrimp. Mm. The shrimp wasn't as spicy in the broth, but it was still good. Good season. Mm. This is off the, off the hook. I know this is Thai food, <laughs> but I can't help to compare it to food I ate in Vietnam. <laughs> I'm going to have to use a spoon on this one. <laughs> when you get deeper into the broth, it gets more spicier, but I kind of like it. Guys, I'm full, okay? But more videos of me eating some Thai food, all right? If you know a restaurant I should visit while I'm here in the city, comment down below. If there's a dish, particular dish, you would love for me to try, comment down below. Understand, I am on a budget, so I can't eat everything on the menu. That's what it is right now. But we're, we're building, all right? So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like this video, share the video, or just leave a like, leave a comment. And i see you in the next video, all right? More videos of me in this country, all right? Bless, and I'll see you in the next one.